Hi, I'm Terry Baricius. I'm a recovering politician. I spent 20 years as a lawmaker. Uh, I was first elected back in 1981 with Bernie Sanders when he was elected mayor of Burlington, Vermont. I was elected to the city council. Served 10 years in the city council, including a term as president. Then I got elected to the state legislature where I served in the House of Representatives for another 10 years. As a legislator, I saw from the inside how our representative system doesn't really work very representatively. And after I left the legislature, after 20 years in elective office, I worked for a national organization working on election reform. And in that work on, uh, as a policy analyst on election reform, I gave testimony to British Columbia Citizens Assembly. Now this was quite eye-opening. The Citizens Assembly was in British Columbia was charged with designing a new voting system for the province. And it was constructed by having one man and one woman randomly selected from each of the, the districts where people were elected from. So it was a randomly selected, like a jury, sort of. And I gave testimony on what I thought they should do for reforming their voting method. But by the end of the process, I had a, a, a quite a revelation. I realized that this is exactly how democracy should be functioning. These were ordinary people who were learning all kinds of details, having deliberation, taking input from all kinds of experts, weighing things and coming to conclusions. And I, from that point on, that was around 2004, 2005, I've been working on democratic lotteries as a superior tool for running a democracy. So I've written a book. I've been working on it for over 10 years the tentative title of the book is The Trouble with Elections. Everything we thought we knew about democracy is wrong. And I have finally gotten to the point where I'm going to be launching it as a serialized blog, if you will, on Substack. Because this book is going to be published as a paper book, you know, sold in bookstores and so on. But my hope is it can be perfected before we get there. So I'm going to ask any of you who want to, to give me feedback on which which sections were confusing, which sections were tangential and really should be cut out, which were so wonderful they need to be expanded on, etc. So I'm hoping you can help with that. We're launching that um, in the, by the end of April and the beginning of May. So if you're seeing this video after that, you probably want to click on the archive button at the top of the Substack and start from the beginning.